Good morning, LA. Today is going to be an extra fun day, just like yesterday and every other day on this trip. Um, we're going to uh, the Griffith Observatory. We're going to get some brunch at this place my friend told me about. And what else are we doing? Oh, yeah, we're going to see the Late Late Show with James Gordon. I can't wait. I'm really excited. So come along. How is your peanut butter crunch toast? <laughs> are you crying? No. You just said you were crying. It's, it's outrageous. It's outrageous. It's outrageous. Guys, go to the Griddle Cafe. They have insane French toast and pancakes. We ate them. We should have videoed more before we ate them. I mean, our guest is um, Adam Devine and Dan Stevens, and I'm very excited. So yeah, I can't wait to tell you all about it. Hi guys, what's up? Um, so unfortunately, as you can tell, I am not in California anymore. I'm home. It's November 1st, and yesterday was October 31st, Halloween, and the episode that I got to see taped live was on last night for a Late Late Show. So I was going to show you a little bit of the episode, show you where I was sitting so you could see me, um, and talk to you guys a little bit about what that was like. So here we go. So there's Dan Stevens, and I'm right there! There's my mom and dad. <laughs> How funny! And Adam Vine, yes! And I'm um, right there! Ah, so cool! So yeah, we made it on TV, me, my mom, and my dad. Um, it was so cool. So we sat to the right of the, or the back right of the studio. We were in like the second row to the back. But honestly, any seat in that studio is a good seat because it's very intimate. And the best part was that the celebrities walked right downstairs, right where we were sitting on the aisle. And I was freaking out because I knew that the guests were Adam and Vine and Dan Stevens. And I love Adam and Vine and Dan Stevens. Um, Adam and Vine is from Pitch Perfect, Workaholics, he just did a new Netflix movie, is so good, um, and then Dan Stevens, I don't watch, what is the show, I don't watch Downton Abbey, but, um, I saw him in the recent Beauty and the Beast remake as the Beast, and he was so good, so it was cool to, like, see him in person, because, like, you don't even realize that there was a person as the Beast, because all the CGI and stuff, so, ah, it was amazing, um, but yeah, so it was a Halloween episode, so when they came down, they threw out, like, candy, so we were, like, not sure if we were gonna be on camera, but I guess because they were, like, throwing candy, they, like, wanted a wider shot so they could, like, see them throwing it, so they were throwing candy, and I was in the shot, and it was really cool, because not only were they like so so close to us but like we were also on camera so yeah it was really fun um so yeah late late show i i really don't watch much of it but um <laughs> i do watch like crosswalk the musical and when he does like take a break like i watch those bits on youtube but I didn't really know, like, the format of the show. I wasn't really familiar like I am with, like, Jimmy Fallon. So, um, I was in for a little bit of a surprise. I do hate to say it, but the experience was a little bit of a love and shove. Um, it was just because, so we had such an incredible, incredible experience the day before we went, when we went to go see Will and Grace. So, it was because they really they filmed the, sh the Late Late Show in, like, an hour and or less, I guess. And it's very quick. Like, they didn't even have, I think Kiss was our musical guest, but, like, they pre-recorded it. So we didn't even have a musical guest. So it was literally, like, opening, and then, like, we watched a bit that they already filmed. And then the guests, and then the outro. It was very quick. And, yeah, it was not disappointing. I just, I guess I wish the experience just kind of lasted longer. Um, you know, 
it, meh. I, I, we were really lucky. I really liked who we got to see, and, like, James Corden is so funny, but I really, really wish we had, like, more time and, like, interaction with the celebrities, but I totally get it, because, you know, they're celebrities, but, um, yeah, so that was my experience at Late Late Show, but, yes, unfortunately, I am home. Um, I'm still going through my content from my trip, so don't worry. I have a whole two days, I believe, worth of Disneyland stuff, which I will get on YouTube soon, so, yeah, um, I hope you guys had a fun Halloween and are having a great November, and, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!